Okay, so I'm going to call the regular, the special meeting to order. Um, uh, any changes to the agenda? I don't believe so. All right, I'm going to carry on the way it's written. Communication from the audience. Yes, oh, Rice, could you state your name, please? Where is Ainsworth, <laughs> lifetime president of Harvick, except for a few months I was gone, but that doesn't count. Um, I'm glad to see that you are doing what I requested. I thank you very much for doing that. I think it's important to have the non-town clerk, town treasurer options to change a charter approved and let them go through. Um, I thought a lot about the town clerk treasurer being appointed rather than elected and I still think it should be elected by the public. Yeah, and the voters will be able to decide. Yes. Yep. And but looking at what OP handed me tonight yep. as your amended ballot, yep. it's not complete. How's that? Um, you've got one, two, three, three places, four places where people can vote, but nowhere in here am I seeing four of the six that were posted in the Gazette. And you've got a new one in here. Four, that, of, the, four of the six what? All right. That you were warned that you were doing for charter changes. Four, four of the six articles, or amend articles. These are articles. a summary of the most significant, okay, it says summary of most significant proposed changes. So they probably abbreviated it for space. Um, if these are just the most, Significant, whoever turned it in may have abbreviated it, which means you did not warn everything that you proposed to change. And is that legal? Am I right that Alberta ran this past bill? Yes. So this has gone through Alberta and the town's lawyer. And the Secretary of State. And the Secretary of State. As it's printed in the Gazette. Uh, we don't, I have no idea about what's printed in the Gazette. Okay. I couldn't comment on that. Because that's, what's, that's what was warned for your public hearing. I don't, I don't, I see that? I don't think so. Well, anyway. Um, I, don't, I don't think that's that no longer. Because nowhere in, in what I Gazette. read from the Gazette, and I've seen two postings, mm -hmm. one for the meeting last week and yeah. one for your meeting next week, your yeah. public hearing. And nowhere did it say that you were going to combine um, the town clerk and town treasurer as a single position. Did no, that's you get, been part of the thing. Okay, but that's, that's not along. what was there. So maybe it's because that wasn't considered significant and you can get away with it not being significant. Again, I'm not okay. sure I, what I was just, printed in the Gazette. I'm just yeah, so It's underlined. I don't know if they did this for space in the paper and due to formatting. Right. But what's underlined, Hardwick Town Charter, summary of most significant Right, that's what I changes. just saw. So I think that- This was not considered significant and that's why it wasn't put there. Yeah. Okay, so, but- to, but, but what was posted in public locations would have been the entire thing. Okay, but nowhere can I read, and I'm quickly reading, this is the warning for the town amended article one. Nowhere does it say that you're not going to be elected Electing Trish, uh, Lister, Fence Viewer, Auditors, and. Yeah, that hasn't changed. Right, but if it's not on this ballot and this is what you approved tonight, then the main reason you were doing the charter change yeah. won't be happening. Unless it's in here in verbiage that. I can't understand, which means a lot of people in the town of Hardwick will not understand. Um, is this the entire, is this one page the entire thing, or is no, it's another page is not printed? It's four pages. No, I know. If actually the last two pages will be your ballot. Right, that I understand. Okay, but again, I'm not reading where you've changed and not voting for, because the three that are this on the second page same. all refer to the yeah. town clerk, town treasurer, and the assistants. Yeah. Um, 
So this is the ballot. This is the page. Right? This is the ballot. So the first page that looks like this would be the ballot mm -hmm. that should contain the information regarding changing selectmen, the select board, removing the listers, the fence viewers, public funds, and auditors. So on the second page it says the complete text of proposed amendments to the town of Hardwick Charter may be obtained from the town offices at the Hardwick Memorial Building. Copies are also located. So there might be more. That's the second page after Article 4. So are you saying that this one here, this second page? Yeah. But that's not your ballot. This is your that's official ballot. ballot. Yeah. Yep. And that has to have everything on it that you want voted. I, um, and I'm not Are you sure it. about that? Because... If it's not here, you can't say I voted for it. Yep. And this is... And then you're going to be signing it. And so the first two pages should be identical to the last two pages, only the last two pages are in voter mode. Yeah. Whereas yeah, what yeah. you're signing tonight is to authorize your town clerk to produce these ballots or whomever's going to produce them. And that's what I will see. I won't see these first two bases, right, pages right. when I vote. Right. The no. second two pages sure. are what I'm going to see. I understand that it, yes, so the summary does include everything, but you're saying that you believe that everything should be included on the ballot. Right, and if somebody um, wants more information on this, that's fine, but you have to list everything that you want the charter to change. So I don't know how that got by our attorney. Maybe I'm just too picky you, but if you can explain to me why it's not here, I'm I not going to be... I don't have the opportunity of looking at your information that's the uh, charter change vote on December 9th. This does not have all of the information. Yeah, it doesn't have it all, clearly. So there's, there's quite a bit more. Um, and it does seem to be the same as the summary. Yeah, because the first two pages is what yeah. you guys are going to take action on. Yeah. I've signed hundreds of these. Um, and it's very technical because it's a charter change. But it still doesn't say you're not, you're going to change where the charter says we vote for Lister. Mm -hmm. So we, we so we're probably going to need some uh, input from in another meeting. Alberta. We could, uh, we could postpone this meeting to a certain date and time. I believe that's an option. Yes. Uh, if we had... And it has to be within 20 days of December 9th because that's when you have... We know. That's why we're pushing. Can we combine it with our next... Um, Next week. Yeah, our next, our next you select board. We next, have a public hearing. We have a public so hearing that night. We could do it. Before that. Yep, with that public hearing. So that's the 18th or 7th, 14th. And you can't count the day that you vote in the 20 days. But if you change it on the 18th, the 21st day is the 9th. Everything we see here. So we either do that or we have a special meeting, but that's probably not going to happen before the 11th what is, or the 18th. Liz, Liz, what is on your first page is on the third page, but your first page doesn't contain everything that, that we talked about yeah. last Thursday night. And the main reason you said you went into the charter to begin with was for the trustees. So. Uh, are you sure that it does? That it's not with any of these references because these are all just referencing articles within the full chart. But if it doesn't specifically state what you're doing but as a voter, it's not educational. Like, we're gonna need, like, everything that's here, 
is here. That's correct. But I'm saying there's oh, an that 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 it that It doesn't have all the text. Out. Yeah, you're right. That all of the text right. isn't here. These are just referencing right. the parts yeah. in the yeah. chart. Okay, so if I yeah. ask you to explain this, yeah. how are you going to tell me that you're not going to be left listening? I give you that four-page complete one. A statement. I went through and took all of these references and pulled them out and said, this is what this is. Well, then what I'm saying is, for a ballot, this is confusing, misleading, and in my opinion, would get a no on everything. And I would push the town, and I will so, push the town to vote no, because this is not saying what you want it to say. It's fighting information. So uh, that's right. We've had, so I asked Alberta that the first time around. Right. And she said that we were not, that this was, she went back and checked with Bill Davies, and as you said, it's gone by the Secretary of State. And what we heard back was that we can't. That this is the way it's done. This is the way it's done. Which is why I put together that four page. To try to explain and it. And I tried to read that. I went home the other night and looked at that for an hour. I threw it in the ground. Oh, I have it here. But it is too confusing. I thought, and I, would say I thought it was very good. Of your public will find it even more confusing. So I don't think, okay, so I think Wiz is right that, um, that we were told before that the way this has to be, the reason that all these is like everything is cited chapter and verse is just because those are citations about things we're proposing to change. I don't change. have that for us. May I see your copy of the, see which of these references talks about the listers? Okay. This is the paper that they gave me last week. But this right here is what was in the gazette. I'm interested in so the uh, this is what uh, what's your name gave me last week. Or we could just not take no action. And we could do it again. But I'm pretty sure this is what we have to approve. Yep. So I kind of feel like so we should let's approve do it. This. Let's, let's take no action, make sure that that's the case, and then come back and say, we can ask Bill to our next meeting to say this is what you need to do. Or have a copy of that email to say this is, this is what the Secretary of State says that we can do. It's not to say that we can, it's that we have to. Because right. I ask right. and we have more detail. Right. But if we have that, if we have that uh, like in writing, this is, this is what it is, rather than we're pretty sure. Right. I think that would be a pretty quick... And we have just enough time to do it. I mean, if we do it in our next meeting. And if Alberta really needs it, we can... Um, we can scramble and get three people together this sure. week. Right. Yep. So let's just say that we're going to get the like the specific requirements in the state of Vermont to Oria so that way she understands. Right. So we've already we already got that for ourselves. Yeah. Terms and offices. Okay. It just says elected officials. So. Yeah. Does it say what you're going to do with the elected offices? And does that not also? This is the one that references right here. And that's yeah, all it says. It's 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 you have fire department that's elected, you have first constable, second constable. Yeah. 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 Y
I think I this is the yeah, wording to, that we have to go with. Yeah. That you do some mailings, yep. that you do some massive advertising and explanations because I People. consider myself pretty intelligent and what you've put out tells me nothing. So this was our first, I believe I made that same comment the first time this came before us because before it was amended it looked an awful lot like this. And so that's why we, um, that's why we came up with a um, list of the, the synopsis thing as a add, add But you on. can't give them that when they're voting. We cannot. No. But I don't, think, I don't think we can give them something that makes sense when we're voting, and I don't know why. No, you can't. You can do it outside, yeah. but are you going to stop every voter going in and explain the ballot? So, so we're, we're going to move, we're we're move on. So we'll notify you, or I said there's a special meeting, but if not, we'll do it the 18th. I would right. like to know what about that you find confusing. Is so it that, just too that, dense? That you guys can take offline. Okay. <laughs> okay. Thank you. Thanks, for us. All right. Um, so we're going uh, to. We have again? one item, and oh, we're going to um, we're going to take no action on that. Okay. And we'll do it next time. Uh, I think they can sit around the table, right? They don't have to sit. Yeah. Like yeah. Come on in. So they hang on. We're closing out a previous meeting. <laughs> so um, I'm going to just blow through select board reports, old business, new business. They're all on the agenda. Everybody good? We yep. don't need any of that. Right. Thank motion you. to adjourn. Most, uh, motion to adjourn. <laughs> Second. Second. <laughs> all in favor? Aye. 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 All right. Let's move on to the next meeting. <laughs>